Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're talking about Ian Machado Gary versus Michael Van Page. Ian Machado Gary, 14-0, minus 120. Underdog, our favorite, 26 years old, 6'3", with a 74-inch reach. Fighting Michael Venom Page. 22 wins, 2 losses, 4-1 in his last 5 fights. The one loss is, is a split decision against Logan Storley. Good grappler, plus 100. 37 years old, 6'3", with a 79-inch reach. Same height, but a 5-inch reach advantage for Michael Venom Page. I, I, Machado Gary has done a lot to impress me in this UFC run that he has had. 18 wins in a row. I don't know how that's possible when he's 14, you know, but uh, eight finishes. The thing that I really like about Machado Gary is that when when it comes down to it, he's able to regroup, stick to a game plan, and not rush anything. I think that's very, very crucial for an up-and-coming fighter, and not everybody has that. You know, he definitely has, a, a, you know, he has three first-round finishes, he has three in the second, and he has one in the third. It's pretty well-rounded. Got a split decision against Jeff Neal in a lackluster performance for both guys. Beat Neal Magny, destroyed him, could have finished him, still destroyed him. And then beat Daniel Rodriguez, which, shocker there. Um, beat Kenan Song, had some adversity in that matchup. And again, I, I, I the thing that worries me a lot is the ability of Michael Venom Page to cover distance, and he has some stupid power. I don't know how Machado Gary stifles that. I, I, I don't think his takedowns are going to be much of a factor. Venom Page is very hard to get taken down unless you're some crazy wrestler. Gary's not that. He's a striker who can clinch and hold you against the cage. He's not going to be stronger than Page. He's obviously not longer with a 5-inch disadvantage in reach. I like Michael Venom Page, and I think he finishes Machado Gary. Subscribe, like, comment, and let me know who you guys are picking. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.